evening. We're in East Hampton, Massachusetts, and we're going to walk around the Oxbow Boat Access location. It's on the Oxbow, and it's very close to the Connecticut River. I'm going to point out all the different features of this area and what, what you might want to do here. So what do you want to learn about? What types of things can you, can you do here? You can canoe and kayak, and you can bring in small boats too. And the Oxbow is connected to Connecticut River at this end, so you can go right out to the river. And you can also walk on certain paths that are close to here. But most people come in for the kayak and then they put in at different places and it's a great adventure. But I'm going to walk around the whole parking lot showing you the different features around this area. Okay, most people put in on this boat ramp here, and there's also a dock over here. And out, outward bound is the Connecticut River itself, and there's a railroad bridge over there. I just saw a railroad <coughs> uh, train go over the railroad bridge. All right, so that's the Connecticut River. If you bring your small boat or canoe or kayak, you can go right out there. And the other place you can go is right out into the Oxbow. The Oxbow is what it says, a large meander that got cut off at some point around 1850. And it's been a great place for people. The Arcadia Wildlife Sanctuary is on the southern end of it. Now, if you bring your boat out here, I bet you the whole trip around that Oxbow is about 1.3 miles or so. And of course, an oxbow is inside, and the inside you'll get to see a lot of egrets and great blue herons. All right, and then and, uh, Route Five is right there, before the railroad bridge. On the other side of the river, river is South Hadley. All right, and in the in the great distance, um, you're gonna if you ever go down there. There's actually the Manhattan River actually comes in here and. The Mill River used to, but they moved it up and it's a little bit, a bit up to Connect River now. All right, that's Mount Nine, the top of the distance. But we're going to go near there. Okay, along the shoreline here. You can also put in here, I brought my boat kayak to this location maybe 50 times and 40 times go down the boat ramp, but about 10 times I just come right out here. It's easier if there's someone in the way. All right, so it's a nice little put in. And then there's woods along the edge here. Okay, and there's parking here, and make sure you read the sign because you got to park in the, whether you have a trailer or if you have a boat top for a kayak or a canoe, you got to park in different places. So they try to stress that. Now in the distance is Mount Nanatuck. There's a Monadnock Metacomic Trail up there. In the foreground is an electrical grid, but right beyond that is the Manhattan Rail Trail, which is East Hampton's uh, pedestrian and bicycle way. It's wonderful. You can take it from the Connecticut River here and go all the way up through East Hampton, all the way to the Southampton border. It's also the Northampton Rail Trail. It comes off of the Nawadic Rail Trail, and they have an extension from downtown Northampton that meets up with the Manhattan Rail Trail. All right, and then on the other side of the river, you see Mount Holyoke range in distance. Mount Holyoke's 
the big mountain right there with its peaks. Okay, and there's the railroad bridge right there. Still highly functional. And this is a great place to go. So I invite you here and we'll do one last panoramic for you. Thank you very much.